Once upon a time in the land of the giant, there lived a giant. I smell the blood of an Englishman. This giant had a golden goose that laid golden eggs. Now the giant's kingdom could only be reached by climbing a magic beanstalk. And the only person who knew the secret of this beanstalk was the evil Black Baron. <laughs> I must try again to get that golden goose away from that giant. Now, whom shall I send up the beanstalk this time? Aha! The perfect choice. That it's a magical, musical day. Something special is coming my way. Dad, where are you? I'm out here, Mother, finishing up the morning chores. That's good. Don't forget to milk Betsy. I already have. Thanks for the milk, Betsy. What's that? You're right. It is a beautiful day. It's a magical, musical day. It's a carousel morning in May. All the world's dressed in circus array. A magical, musical day. Good morning, Jack. Good morning, Mother. Isn't it a beautiful day? It is indeed. It's a wonderful, whimsical day. Weeping willows are acting so gay. Found the needle I lost in the hay. A wonderful, whimsical day. That's it. It's a day to have fun and to do as you please. There's a hunting a sun and a bell ring a breeze in the trees, singing wood wind melodies. It's a special, exceptional day. Something special is coming my way. Feel like jumping and shouting, hooray! A special, exceptional, wonderful, whimsical, magical, musical to do. Now take the milk inside the house before it's sour. Yes, Mother. Ah, oh, this is Spray. The Black Baron. I am delighted to see you and your son so happy. This must mean you have your yearly tax money ready. Oh, the tax money. Surely you have well, not uh, forgotten. You owe me a yearly tax for allowing you to live on my property. No, no, I haven't forgotten. It's just that this year has been so much more difficult. So little rain. The crops have been poor. Why, we barely have enough to clothe and feed ourselves. I have offered to assist you before, for many years now, ever since your husband died. My husband is not dead. After 10 years, you can still believe that. Yes, he disappeared. But I know someday he'll return to us. Then you would refuse my offer of marriage once again? Yes. Very well. But be warned. 
You have until tomorrow morning to pay up your taxes, or else I will have you and your son thrown into prison. Oh, no, no! You can't do that to my mother, you... Stupid boy! Do you not know that I have the powers of darkness at my disposal? Now, until tomorrow morning. Mother, what are we going to do? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. We haven't anything of value to sell. Ooh. Unless, of course, Betsy. No, Mother, not Betsy. Hush, son. Betsy understands. Now you take her down to the marketplace and sell her this morning. It's our only chance of getting enough money to pay for the taxes. Yes, Mother. Well, come along, Betsy. I guess I'd best get you ready for town. A special, exceptional day, indeed. So, they are planning to sell their cow, are they? Oh, no, I shall prevent that. I must get Jack to exchange that cow for these magic beans of mine. It is time he made the journey I have planned for him. Let's see. I will need a disguise. Yes. I will disguise myself as an old peddler and change my voice. <laughs> Well, Betsy, I guess there's no help for it. We have to sell you. Be sure to get a good price for her, Jack. And don't talk to any strangers on the way. Yes, Mother. Goodbye, dear. Oh, Betsy. Goodbye. And the milk you gave us We remember you And your gentle way of saying Moo We'll meet again Beans, beans, I have magic beans. What are you selling, old peddler? Beans, beans, I have magic beans. I never heard of magic beans. Well, then, listen. Beans, beans, I have magic beans. They're so clean, they're so lean, the greenest beans you've ever seen. Beans, beans, I have magic beans. Marvelous, mystical, miracle, magical beans. Beans for you to buy, beans for you to try. I mean, these beans are guaranteed to make you fly. Somewhere over the beanstalk, way up high. Please buy some, won't you try some? See the way they glow They're magical beans, you know It's a special, exceptional day Something special is coming my way Could it be these beans? Please buy some, won't you try some? Beans, beans, he has magic beans They're so clean, they're so lean The greenest beans I've ever seen Beans, beans, he has magic beans Marvelous, mystical, miracle, magical beans. How do they work? What are they good for? First you dig a hole. Dig it very deep. 
Then you plant the beans, give them a little water, and then you go to sleep. And while you are asleep, the magic starts to flow. And suddenly the beans begin to grow and 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 grow so high that when you wake up, you'll see your beans start growing up to the sky. But what do I do with it? You climb it. Where does it lead? To riches and golden treasure. Oh, but I have no money with which to buy such wonderful beans. Perhaps you have something you could trade for them. No. Unless... Moo! No, I must sell our cow at the market to get money to pay our taxes. But if you trade your cow for these beans, you will have enough riches for the rest of your life. Will? Yes, if you do as I tell you. Atop the beanstalk, there is a great castle in which you will find a golden goose. A golden goose that lays golden eggs. Each of these eggs alone is worth a fortune. All you have to do is bring the golden goose back with you and you will have golden eggs to make you richer than any king. Wait a minute. Why haven't you climbed the beanstalk and brought back all these riches? Oh, I'm too old for such a journey. Only a young boy such as yourself could possibly make it there and back. Now, what do you say? Will you trade your cow for these beans? I... I... Moo. Moo. Yes. Here, take Betsy. Give me those beans. Beans, beans. I have magic beans. They're so clean, they're so lean, the greenest beans I've ever seen. Beans, 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 beans. I have magic beans. He has magic, marvelous, mystical, miracle, magical beans. I have beans. He has beans. Magic beans. Thank you, old peddler. You've saved our lives. Hurry now and plant those beans. I will. And, old peddler, if you ever pass this way again, I'll give you all the golden eggs you desire. Thank you, yes. You're a very good boy. Now I must tell my mother. Oh, Betsy, we'll meet again somehow. But for now, goodbye, little cow. Mother! Oh, I mother. should thrash you! Oh. How could you be so stupid? But, Mother, the man said they would Do you grow. realize what you've done, Jack? By tomorrow morning, we might be thrown into prison. Oh, but if I plant the beans now... Beans! Dreams! Just like your father. He, too, started out one morning for the marketplace and never returned. He was probably swindled out of all of his money and was too ashamed to return and face me. Oh, what will become of us? What will become of us? Oh, please don't cry, Mother. Look, let me plant the beans and see what happens. All right. You do that. I'm too tired to care anymore. First, I dig a hole. Dig it very deep. Then I plant the beans. Give them a little water. And then I go to sleep. Beans. Beans. I have magic beans. Marvelous. Mystical. Miracle. Magical. I was too old, my boy. 
but only an innocent youth like yourself could possibly climb such an enchanted beanstalk. Soon he will awaken and do my bidding. And when he has returned with the golden goose, I shall seize it and have that boy and his mother thrown into prison. Then all the gold will be mine. <laughs> as I can. Oh, my son, I'll never see you again. Yes, you will, Mother. Oh, no. Well, here I go. I'm climbing right up, climbing right up, right up the beanstalk. I never have seen, never have seen, seen such a green stalk. It's gonna be fun, gonna find out, find out who lives there. Find out what gives there And whatever it may or may not be I'm gonna try bringing it back with me Higher, higher, higher I'm up in the clouds now Hello, moon Hello, sun It won't take long Hand over hand Till I reach that promised land up, up, now I must not stop, here I am, at the top. What a strange life. is so huge. There's the castle. It must be a mile high. I wonder who lives there. Go away, go away, go away, away, away. You're now in the land of the giant and you must not stay. Go away, go away, 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 away. You're now in the land of the 
the giant and you must not stay. Go away, go away, go away, away, away. You're now in the land of the giant and you must not stay. You might become a client. A client for the giant. The giant kills his clients and he dies. Sometimes he is defiant. A most defiant giant. He has a nose that knows when there are pine spying little boys. Go away, go away, go away, away, away. You're now in the land of the giant and you must not stay. Go away, go away, go away. Excuse me, but I don't understand. What giant? The giant who lives in the great castle. Well, I know nothing of him, but can you tell me if that's the castle that houses a wondrous golden goose that lays golden eggs? Ah, 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 go away, go away, go away, away, away. The goose belongs to the giant and you must not stay. Oh, but I can't leave. I must find the golden goose. Ah, 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 go away, go away, go away, away, away. The goose belongs to the giant and you must not I think this song is pretty dumb. Why is it that every time I come out for a breath of fresh air, everybody runs? Just because I'm a little bit taller and they're a little bit smaller, everybody runs. Makes you feel very insecure. Gets you right here. Something very strange is going on around here. I have a nose beyond compare. And my nose knows that my fee foes detect a whiff and a sniff of a stranger hiding somewhere. No, oh, fee, fi, fo, fum. I smell the blood of an Englishman. Fa, fo, fi, fee, where, oh, where can he be? Oh, fee, fi, fo, fum. I smell the blood of an Englishman. Fa, fo, fi, fee, where, oh, where can he be? Is he over there? Is he over here? Something tells me he is very near. Oh, fee, fi, fo, thumb. I smell the blood of an Englishman. Thumb, fo, fi, fee. Where, oh, where can he be? Gee, fee, fi, fo, thumb. I smell the blood of an Englishman. Thumb, fo, fi, fee. Where, oh, where can he be? Gee, fi, fo, thumb. He smells the blood of an Englishman. Thumb, fo, fi, fee. Where, oh, where can he be? Is he over there? Is he over here? Something tells me he is very near. Oh, fee, fi, fo, fum. I smell the blood of an Englishman. Fum, oh, fi, fee. Where, oh, where can he be? Fee, fi, fo, fum. I smell the blood of an Englishman. Fum, fo, fi, fee. Where, oh, where can he be? Oh, fee, fi, fo, fum. Smells the blood of an Englishman. Fun, fo, fun, fee. Oh, where, oh, where can he be? Is he over there? Is he over here? Something tells me he is very near. Fun, fo, fun. Smells the blood of an Englishman. Fun, fo, fun, fee. Oh, where, oh, where can that be? That's he! All right, young man, who are you and what's your name? My name is Sprague. Jack Sprague. Sprague. Jack Sprague. That name rings a bell. Hmm. Sprague, huh? Well, the name's familiar, but I can't place the face. What are you doing up here? I came in search of the golden goose that lays the golden eggs. A spy, huh? Who sent you? Well, no one sent me. I, I... You lie, you lie, you lie, you lie, you lie. The giant gets when he catches a spy. Boy, do I get upset when someone tries to steal my inventions. I didn't know. I, I... You lie, you lie, you lie, you lie, you lie. The giant gets defiant when he catches a spy. In fact, I'm hurt. Nobody loves me for me. Everybody's after my gold. Well, we've got a cure for spies like you. 
You're coming back to the castle with me. No, please. I only climbed up, only climbed up, up in the blue here. A very likely story. I wanted my dreams, wanted my schemes all to come true here. Oh, yeah? Well, three, five, four, thumb. I've caught myself an Englishman. Ha, bum, four, five, three. Away he goes with me. No, oh, no, help, help, help. Hey, let me go to your hands. And I've got the head for it. <laughs> now, where's my housekeeper? Right here, Great Giant. And my assistant. Right here, Great Giant. All right, let's remove this cage and get the boy strapped into that chair back there. No! Oh, yes. no. No, no. Hold no! Hold on there. Oh, That's oh. the girl. Oh, let me go. Let me go. You're not going anywhere. You're my prisoner right here in my secret laboratory. Not only am I a great giant, I am also the world's greatest scientific inventor. Up here they call me the Giant Brain. Though I've got a giant scientific brain, I'm a scientific giant, so you may. I'm as gentle as can be, and I wouldn't harm a flea. So I'll sing for you my giant brain refrain. Oh, take a giant step and come with me. My giant castle beside the giant sea. Take a giant step into my giant vault, and I will serve us both a frosty giant chocolate malt. I invented giant malts, you know. No, oh, take a giant step, and off we go to a giant castle where giant redwoods grow. On a giant field, we'll have a giant game, for I'm the greatest batter in the Giants Hall of Fame. Oh, yes, I invented baseball, too. They named one of the larger teams after me. The Giants? <laughs> oh, I see a little dance coming on. A little giant tango. Thank you so much. Now, prepare the boy for immediate decontamination examination. No! No! Yes. him down a good bit. All except one leg. One leg seems to be kicking here. I know. We'll give him some of my forget to kick formula. Forget to kick formula. Forget to kick formula. That's what I said. 
That's better. Now, some of my extra special formula. GTS. GTS. Yes, 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 yes. You'll never guess about GTS. Stands for Giant Truth Serum. Wait till he gets a squirt of this. All right, prepare the arm. Uh, arm. Arm. Alcohol on the cotton. 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 Alcohol. 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 On the cotton. On the cotton. On the cotton. All right, here we go. One. Two, three, squirt! <laughs> now, let's see if this is working. Can you hear me, Jack? I can hear you, giant! See, being a fresh kid. Hmm. All right, now tell the truth. Why have you come to my kingdom? To seek the golden goose. Oh, a spy. Who sent you? No one. My mother and I are poor. We need money to pay our taxes, or else the evil Black Baron will have us thrown into prison. That is why I seek the Golden Goose. Oh, that poor kid. Hmm. How did you find out how to get here? An old peddler traded me magic beans for our cow. He told me to plant the beans, climb the beanstalk when it grew, and that here I would find the Golden Goose. But he didn't tell me about a giant living up here. Hurrah! That's what they all say. Heard the same story about 10 years ago. Sprague, Sprague. Hmm. That name sure rings a bell. Well, he must be telling the truth because he's under my giant truth there. Very well. Untie the boy and I'll wake him up. Yes, giant. Housekeeper, run into the kitchen and prepare some food for this boy. Yes, he must yes, be famished after that trip up the beanstalk. All right, fella. Up and at him. Oh, what happened? I feel so strange. Well, you look a little strange. <laughs> no, I've had you, I've had you under examination. I'm glad to tell you that you're not a spy. What are you going to do with me? Well, I sent for some food. We're going to fatten you up for the kill. Oh, no. oh, oh I'm just joking. <laughs> just a little giant joke. <laughs> you fail to get the giant humor of it, don't you? Uh, ooh, well, here's the food right now. There you are. Now, bring in the golden heart. Uh, yes, giant. The golden heart? Uh-huh. Didn't know about the golden heart, eh? I always like to have a little music with my dinner. And here he is now. <laughs> I not only invented the golden harp, I also invented the golden goose. And you'll see her in just a minute. But right now, harp, I command you to play. Plink a plunk a plink a plunk a plink a plunk a plunk a plink with a plink and a plunk. With a plink, plink, and a plunk, plunk. With a plink, a plink, a plink, a plunk, a plunk, a plunk, a plink, a plunk or two. I'll play a golden song for you. Plink a plunk, a plink a plunk, a plink a plunk, a plunk a plink. I never play flat. I never play sharp. The angels in heaven have no finer heart. With a plink and a plunk. With a blink, blink, and a plunk, plunk. With a blink, a blink, a blink, a plunk, a plunk, a plunk, a plunk, a plunk. Uh-oh. His plinker seems to be on the plunk. Huh. I have to wind him up. Hold it! Hold it! Not so fast. You'll get yourself all unstrung that way. Come on, I'll take it from the coda. Plink a plunk a plink a plunk a plink a plunk a plunk a plink with a plink and a plunk with a plink plink and a plunk plunk with a plink a plink a plink a plunk a plunk a plunk a plink a plunk or two. I'll play a golden song for you. Plink a plunk a plink a plunk a plink a plunk a plunk a plink. I never play flat. I never play sharp. The angels in heaven have no fun. With a plink and a plunk, with a plink, plink and a plunk, plunk, with a plink, a plink, a plink, a plunk, a plunk, a plunk, a plink, a plunk, or two. You play a golden song for you. Plink a plunk, a plink a plunk, a plink a plunk, a plink a plink. Charming, just charming. Good fellow. You may not believe this, but his father was a cello. He's most remarkable. Isn't he? And now my greatest invention, the golden goose. Assistant, bring in the golden goose. Yes, giant. Does she really lay golden eggs? Do her two dozen a day, extra large, 14-carat, grade A eggs. 
And here she is now. How extraordinary. All right, Goosey, do the egg bit. Honk, honk. Here's another golden egg for you. Good girl, just sit on it and keep it warm, dear. How wonderful, she talks, too. Not only does she talk, she sings. Listen to this. Sing out, Goosey. Honk, honk. A golden a goose am I. A goose not meant to fly. With head of gold and wings of gold. And gold and meat and legs. My only use is to produce these famous golden eggs. Honk, honk. Call them golden eggs. Solid golden eggs. You can't break them even if you drop them. Even if you drop them on the floor Oh, them golden eggs Solid golden eggs Golden eggs you can't buy in the store Giant. Well, that's true. A and now, you're going to be my first assistant. Mm. Oh, mm. sorry, Touchy. My first assistant assistant. What do you mean? Well, I mean, you got to help out around here. Everybody works. Oh, but I have to go home. My mother needs me. Oh, I'm sorry, kid. That's impossible. Once you get caught up here, you have to stay forever, and sometimes longer. Oh, but I can't. Never say, I can't. Always say, I can. Positive thinking. One of my golden rules. My mother is in danger. Well, you should have thought about that before you come up here, kid. See my assistant over there? Came up here about 10 years ago, same as you. Tried to steal a golden goose, same as you. Tried to get away, same as you. But I caught him, same as you. <laughs> I gave him a shot of my forget who you are formula, and he's been my assistant ever since. Oh, but I mean you no harm. Oh, I'm sorry, kid, that's tough. Uh, them's the rules, and I make them. <laughs> now, prepare some of the forget who you are formula. Forget who you are formula. Forget who you are formula. All righty, that's what I said. Forget who you are formula. Give the boys some of the forget-who-you-are formula while I take another look around the castle. There may be more spies about. Yes, Giant. Good job. Uh, clear this food away. I will give the formula to the boy. Now, drink this. No. Please, I don't want to forget who I am. No. You must drink Please. this. Please, I, I don't... Oh. Shh. We only have a moment. I'll help you to escape, but you must help me as well. What do you mean? I'll tell the giant I've given you the formula, but you must pretend to forget who you are and where you come from. I see. And then when the giant's asleep, we'll both escape down the beanstalk. Why are you helping me? As he told you, I had been given the forget formula. And for many years, I've been trapped here doing the giant's bidding. I must have a home and a family somewhere. I'll help you if you'll help me to find out who I am and where I belong. It's a bargain. Hey, He's coming. Oh, Remember, oh. look like. You don't know who you are or where you belong. Right. All right, assistant, have you given the boy the forget formula? I did, great giant. Very good. You may retire. Good night. Good night, giant. 
Who are you? Uh, I don't know. Very good. Where do you come from? Uh, I don't know. Marvelous. All the right answers. All right, young man. You might take that blanket and curl up in the corner over there. Yes, giant. Good night. Good fellow. Good fellow. Well, everything seems to be fine here. No one can steal the golden goose, you know. For if anyone touches her, she honks, which causes the harp to plink, wakes up my housekeeper, and she comes running in here and says, Who's there? You don't believe me, hey? Watch this. Honk, honk, plink, plink. Who's there? Every time. <laughs> Just testing, dear. Back to bed. <laughs> hmm. I wonder if I'm doing the right thing. Maybe I should let him go back to his mother. Tell you what I'll do. I'll sleep on it. It's not easy being a giant. So many giant decisions. As you told me, it worked. He thinks I've forgotten who I am. It's time we escaped. Hurry! We must get out of here. We must get out of here. It's getting late. We must not wait, or all is lost, I fear. We must get out of here. We must get out of here. When the time is right to take our flight, we must get out of here. Let's hide! Who's there? All is quiet. It must have been the wind. It must have been the wind. I heard the hop. My ears are sharp, but it must have been the wind. It must have been the wind. Here. We must get out of here. It's getting late. We must not wait, or all is lost. I fear. We must get out of here. We must get out of here. The time is right to take our flight. We must get out of here. Quick, let me take just one of the golden eggs. No, no, no. You wake the giant. Oh, but it's my only chance to get money and save my mother. No, don't, please. Secret passage! Who's there? Stop, stop, oh stop! Oh giant, wake up! Wake what, up! What's going on around here? There are six in that boy escaping with one of the golden eggs! What? Plow them all on earth! Quick, we'll cut them off with the beanstalk! Come on, goose! Come on, heart! Come on, housekeeper! Now you are under my spell. That stupid boy of yours has not returned with the golden goose. But at least now I will have you for my wife. <laughs> Mother! Mother! That's his voice. He is returning. I must hide. Mother! I'm home. I brought back a golden egg. Mother! What's happened? What's wrong? Aha! One of the golden eggs. It alone is worth a fortune. It is the great giant. He is climbing down the beanstalk. That's the golden goose. I must have it. I'll chop down the beanstalk.
I thought he'd never leave. That was a nasty trick, chopping down my beanstalk. You've hurt my feelings, among other things. There's my assistant, the boy. Quick, give them some of the wake-up drops. At once, great giant! Oh, the giant! And all is lost. No, nothing's lost except the way home. This nut chopped down my beanstalk. That's the Black Baron, the evil one that would have thrown my mother and me into prison. Is this your mother? Oh, my mother, yes. I hope he hasn't harmed her. Quick, give her some of the wake-up drops. She looks familiar somehow. Oh. oh, Jack, you've come home. Yes, Mother, fear not. The evil Baron no longer has you in his power. The giant helped us. And... The giant? Here, let me give her some of those wake-up formula. Oh. oh, my husband. Oh! She did it again. What did she say? She called me husband. Now I remember. I once had a wife and a little boy. Then you must be my father. And you must be my son. Dad! Ah. Oh, my husband. You've returned. My oh. dear. Now, would you believe that? Here, here, what's going on over there? I've regained my memory, O oh giant, as well as my wife and my son. My name is Sprague. Sprague? Well, I knew that name rang a bell. Hmm. And it was the evil Black Baron who sent me to get the Golden Goose. He sold me magic beans that grew the giant beanstalk. He must have been the old peddler. He did the same with me. Well, isn't that just like a Black Baron for you? We'll fix him. Housekeeper, give me some of my sweetness and light formula. At one great giant. Best formula I ever invented. Watch this. You see? All sweetness and light. But you have to be careful not to give them too much of this, or they get sickening. Thanks, giant. Oh, that's all right, any time. But now, where am I to go? I can't go home. My beanstalk's busted. I have a castle. You may all come and live with me. Well, that's right neighborly of you, Baron. Uh, do you mind if I bring along my housekeeper, my golden harp, and my golden goose? Not at all. You may all come and live with me, and particularly the golden goose. Honk, honk, plink, plink. Who's there? Every time. I went and climbed up, went and climbed up, climbed up the beanstalk. I never had seen, never had seen, seen such a green stalk. But now I find out, now I find out things weren't so bad there. I found my dad there. And now I'll never roam again. I'm glad to be back home again. Take a giant step, go back two, three. Take another step and come with me. Come up to my castle, I'll enlarge the door. And we will all live happily forevermore. Let's see. It's a day to have fun. Oh, my God. 